Hey yo, what's going on gamers? It's your boy Daily here and today we are going to be opening up this shiny fate oh, shiny fates shining fates ETB. Um, I am currently collecting every oh sorry every shiny card uh, from this set and I've got maybe a fourth of them collected I want to say at this point I, I don't know <laughs> something like that not a lot so I bought a bunch of these uh, Shining Fates ETBs you get the booklet right here uh, just to go ahead and uh, try and finish off most of the set by pulling them myself and then eventually you know we probably won't pull every single card from this thing go ahead and actually rip open um, in a live stream the rest of the packs I, I think that could be kind of cool or at the very least we could go ahead and uh, just purchase them online and finish it off that way yet another little booklet right here on how to play the game and then here are your packs uh, so we got one two three four five six seven eight nine ten and then you get, ah, there it is, the promo card. Very nice. These are usually like fairly clean if they're in these wrappers, which is good. Um, and yeah, that's about it. You get some energy, stuff like that. Nothing too crazy in the rest of that thing. Uh, but let's go ahead and pull open 10 Shining Fates packs here, hoping to get some of the Shiny Vault uh, I have already finished Hidden Fates. Hidden Fates was a really fun one to collect. Um, and now we're going for Shining Fates. So we have a Floatzel, Cramorant, Rusted Sword, Gossifleur, Cacnea, Kufant, Buizel, Spinarak, Luxio. And the reverse is where the Shining card would be. So we didn't get anything from that. Uh, and nothing in that pack as a whole so basically a load of garbage nothing uh all that special in that entire thing kind of a bummer let's see if charizard can bring us some luck oh i do wait did i see something a little shiny right there let's just cacnea kufin eevee weasel oh okay an amazing rare and a and a hollow okay a double pack right there not too bad um, I will gladly take that. We'll put the hits in the back here. I do really love these amazing rares. And you know what? I will go ahead and sleeve up that amazing rare right now. I think amazing rares, oh my God, this is so off center. The back looks okay, but the front is super off center. That's terrible. That would grade like a eight, I think, just based on centering. Um, but I think amazing rares are one of those cards that's gonna be worth a lot in the future. They didn't print a whole lot of them and they're really cool. So unless they bring them back at some point, which they might. I mean, they've done it before with, like, the trainer gallery cards. All right, Greedent V. Um, you know, maybe they will. I kind of doubt it. But if they did, uh, no, I, yeah, yeah, I really doubt they did. I, they do. Because Sword and Shield is coming to a close pretty soon here. Like, what are the odds they decide to bring back a Sword and Shield gimmick for a new set? That seems incredible. Hey, there we go. Uh, Galarian Obstagoon. I do already have this Shining card, uh, so doesn't really do all that much for me, but at least it's a pull, you know? <laughs> we'll take pulls, we'll take pulls. All right, <sighs> hoping for some full arts. Obviously, I would take that Charizard in a heartbeat. Grookey and a Demlice, however you pronounce that. Um, the Charizard, uh, VMAX Shiny, I, I've taken a heartbeat, but uh, I already have that one actually as well. So we don't need it, but I would take it gladly. <laughs> gladly. All right, let's see. We'll skip right to it. And that did not bring us any luck. <laughs> Skipping right to it didn't do anything for that pack. Maybe it even cursed it. So let's go back uh, to doing a pack trick for this next one. These kinds of sets I always think are the best. Oh, I'll put this out here. This is like technically a hit, even though it's guaranteed. Um, I really like these sets the best, the ones that have the shinies in them, Hidden Fates in this. Um, I think they're just super fun. 
and super collectible. That's why I often go for these instead of um, collecting like other sets like Chilling Rain or something like that. Uh, we do have a pull here and it's gonna be a Cinderace VMAX. Not too bad. All right, you know, I'll take a VMAX. That's, uh, that's worthy of a sleeve. I don't think these VMAXs will ever be worth a whole lot in the future. They're just not that beautiful of artwork, in my opinion. They, they just look very generic. They all kind of look the same. So I doubt those will ever end up being worth a ton. But a hit is a hit, and we're not gonna complain. It's probably like a $2 card, I wanna say, maybe three bucks, something like that. Come on, give us another shiny. All right, more Peko, Eevee, Yanma, Snoom, and a Floatzel, and a Zarud. Nothing in that one. We've only got two packs left from this. We're gonna slow roll them. Oh, baby, okay, come on, come on. Two packs, two packs left. We gotta slow roll these. We have to pray. We have to hope and pray. We got the Cramorant, Skiing, Rusted Sword, Luxio jumping on ya. Yanma, more Pekko. This has always been one of my favorite arts. It's so cute. I like that a lot. Eevee doing a little swimming. That's also a really great card. Glossifleur, and this is going to be Yanma. All right, all right, all right. I think the next one. Ooh, okay. Hey, you know what? I will take that. And uh, Yanmega, we, did we get the entire line of Yanmas? Oh, we got two Yanmas and a Yanmega. Wait, what the heck? We got two of the same card in that pack. That's super, I don't, that's very rare to get. Um, okay, that's an interesting little error pack right there. Either way, an amazing rare Kyogre has been pulled. Uh, this one, extremely off center like the last one. This, this must have been the exact same, uh, print run of these, which resulted in some pretty shoddy printing. Uh, but hey, gladly take an Amazing Rare Kyogre. I think those Amazing Rares are in fact amazing. So take as many as I can get. All right, last chance for some shiny action here. Come on, baby. Floatzel, Rusted Sword, Luxio, Morpeko, Cacnea, Horsey, Kufunt, Choodle, I love Choodle. Eevee, Reverse, and a Dreadnought, so nothing. Oh my God, we got one shiny out of this entire Elite Trainer box. A pretty poor box um, in terms of shinies, but at the very least, um, we didn't come out of it dry, you know? We got some pulls, so I'll, I'll gladly take that. Um, and these amazing rares, I, I will gladly take. Um, those are definitely the highlights of the box for me. Either way, guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Please be sure to hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you all in the next one, per usual. Peace.